So good afternoon and welcome to this virtual tour by Goldacre Estate. Uh, today we're in Orega Mar looking at this duplex villa. It's a two bedroom corner unit here uh, in Machanicho, a villa number 840. Great, great location because as you can see behind me, you've got miles and miles of open space by the side of this semi-detached villa. Here it is just now behind me. So let me turn the camera around and show you around from the outside. So this villa then, just by one of the pedestrian crossings uh, here in Oregomar. That road there actually leads you back to the hotel. So you can uh, have a short stroll to the hotel facilities from here. This particular position is the corner unit, two bedroom, as you can see here, duplex. To the side, you've got two one bedroom units and then another corner, two bedroom. So it's actually only one of four properties in one row. So it's actually a preferred or preferential position here. Front garden, as you can see, really spacious here it's quite a length on this front garden that leads you into the front door lounge kitchen area and then the bedroom and bathroom behind that of course internal stairs leading you up to the bedroom and bathroom as well upstairs and there is actually a terrace off the south side there looking over the pool areas beautiful roof line tiles here as you can see in Oregamar. all the fences of course at the moment are being reinstated so they're actually down at the moment as you can see here this whole area has just recently been completely de-weeded and pecan is laid this front gate has just been replaced so it's absolutely brand new and you can see here by this corner post which marks the end of this particular position then that if i was to stand here you can actually see the width of this garden uh, then by the side of this two bedroom literally then and i put just for your convenience a little marker a little water bottle there to see the end of the garden you can see the distance there from this point and also appreciate then that to the right of that is the garden here quite a width quite a large space in the front here of this two bedroom in a moment i'll walk up to the end and show you from the rear of the building from this line then to the left you can see very very open space here one of the largest open spaces and indeed then if you're looking for a private villa this one as a corner unit has a lot of space to the side of this garden standing by the front door this is the front terrace area as you can see wooden pergola there and then again from this position here you can see the actual end of the garden pillar right there so you can imagine then the width of this particular position and if i pan over here to the right you can see then start to appreciate the distance you have from this property across the communal areas and your neighbors in the distance that's actually the swimming pool so you've got an elevated view across the pool it's actually being worked on today just about half an hour ago everybody came off site that's been completely refurbished as we speak so literally now as i start to count my paces out from the front garden walking to the rear of the property just to check my marker you can see that the pool on the left there again here on the right loads of space in front of this property towards your neighbours. If I pan around now, you can see these four buildings then, this corner unit here. And looking back at the post, you can appreciate now the width that you have from this position. So there's the upstairs bedroom terrace and the downstairs bedroom and bathroom. Here's the line between this and the next door property. And of course, if you're panning around here then to the marker, you can see the width of this back garden. And the key point here is that this back garden actually then looks out across open land towards the pool. So even from your garden, you've still got all of this expanse in front of you. So I've just popped upstairs uh, to the adjoining building through the spiral staircase there. Unfortunately, we can't get into the two bedroom today as there was works going on site. And I just really wanted to show you the 
elevation and the view out across the common ground areas. Just down there you can see my marker, the blue, little blue uh, water bottle. So you can imagine exactly where your fencing is going. But then just imagine after that, this open expanse that you have, looking over the swimming pool. And of course, some of the landscape gardening that they're going to be doing. And here on the right as well, really, really open space. So plenty of privacy from this particular position. Car parking in the distance there as well, as well as across the road from here. And although this is the next door roof terrace, just a glimpse of what you can see from your bedroom window. As you look across the other side of this property, there is open piece of land looking towards the sea. So you've got actually sea views from the upstairs master bedroom. Lastly then, I thought I'd just show you a quick pano of the pool work that's been going on uh, today. There's been a lot of fiberglass work going on. You can see new uh, fence posts going in as we speak. And then just looking back at Villa 840, there it is on the corner there, on the right hand side of that four. So it's quite a distance from here, really nice open space. And as you can see from there to your neighboring property on the right, quite a large gap. And that actually takes you down then to the lookout uh, tower, if you like, or lookout point that looks across the hotel to the Atlantic Ocean and Lanzarote. So I hope that was uh, a helpful update on that particular position. All the details, of course, will be coming onto our website soon.